Hi guys, Tate James here. In this video, I'll be showing you guys how to convert and watch video or film on your old 3DS or new 3DS. This pretty much just works on every model. So the first thing you want to do is just go ahead and power off your 3DS fully. You're then going to want to take out your 3DS's SD card and then go ahead and connect this to your PC. Alright guys, so once you're on your computer and your 3DS's SD card is plugged in, you want to head over to the first link in the description. Um, this is just going to bring you to a Mega Drive page. From here you can download the 3DS video converter software. So go ahead and just click the download button. So I couldn't actually find the original version of this. I did find a mirrored version, so I thought I'd just mirror it myself again. So once the file's downloaded, it's very small in size. Just head over to your PC's download folder. So all I've got here is a video, which I want to copy across. It's in an MP4 format, so MP4, WMV, all of those kind of formats work with this. So once you've got the software right here, all you want to do is right click it and then do extract here. Then go ahead and open up the folder. So with this software you don't actually need to install it, you can just run it like portably. So just double click the 3DS video converter and it will open. Then just head over back to your downloads folder and open up the software again. So what you need to do here is go on your 3DS's SD card, which is right here. Go to the DCIM folder. Um, go into this folder right here. Um, but pretty much just choose any of these folders. Choose the latest one. And as you can see, this is where all my previous pictures and videos are. So what I want to do now is just open this back. And as you can see, my format is different. And my format is HNI instead of NIH. So I'm just going to put that in. So HNI. Then you need to choose a starting number. So I need to choose a number that isn't here already. So I can pretty much just do it, choose anything. So I'm just going to put in 22 just so it comes after this one. Um, now you can use 3D video quality if you want to. I wouldn't recommend it. Um, you can use two digits for a long video. I think my video is only about three minutes, so that should be fine. Now what you need to do is do your output folder. So just click browse and go on this PC and choose your downloads folder and then just click OK. This is just going to save the converted video into your downloads folder. So now head over back to your downloads folder, get the video that you want, um, just drag it and drag it straight into the software and drop it onto this icon. It's then just going to bring it up. All you need to do now is just click convert. I guess it's going to finish and it says all videos converted. All you have to do now is just click the X button. Here it is guys in the exact right format in the AVI format. So then we're just going to select the 3DS SD card, select DCIM, copy this across to the file. Now just click on the file folder and make sure it's in there. So that is pretty much it. Now I'm going to head over to my 3DS and I'll show you guys what to do next. Alright guys, so I'm over on my 3DS now. All you want to do is just open up the camera application. Just give it a few seconds to prepare. Then select view photos and videos. Then just click OK. It's then just going to update the database. Then click OK again. Now just scroll along and you will find your video. So I believe this is the one that I copied across. So I'm just going to press A to um, you know, watch it. So there it is guys, the video, clo video is running perfectly fine, you can go on video tools, you can skip um, certain parts of the video as well. So the quality is actually pretty good considering this is running off a of 3DS, um, definitely watchable, full working sound and everything like that. So that's pretty much it for this video, so if you guys enjoyed, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.